Okay, here we have a level 1 bar chart question. Steph works at a car park near a railway station. This table shows information about the numbers of parking tickets sold from May to August 2014. Steph has to write a report for her manager. She wants to draw a bar chart to show this information. Make a bar chart for Steph. I'm just going to stop there. I'm going to ignore all of this information because right now I don't need it. I've got everything I need for this question so I'm just going to focus on that. Okay, important things to remember for bar charts is to label everything and quite helpfully it's given you all the boxes that you need to label stuff in. Uh, our scale needs to start at zero and our, well, of course we need to draw our bars accurately to the data. So I know what these bars are going to represent because I've got four pieces of data and I've got four categories across the bottom. So these are going to be the months that we're looking at. So we have May, June, July and August. Uh, next I'm going to decide on my scale. So I know it needs to start at zero but what's it going to go up in? Uh, I'm going to pick a nice number first. Let's say it's going up in 100s. Well, then this would be 100, 200, 300, 400, 500, 600, 700. Well that's no good going up to 700 because my data goes up into the thousands. So why don't I try something bigger like 500? This would be 500 then 1,000, 1,500, 2,000, 2,500, 3,000, 3,500, which is pretty good, but it still doesn't doesn't let you plot bar charts for bars for these really high numbers. So what about thousands? Let's try that. Go zero, 1,000, 2,000, 3,000, 4,000, 5,000, 6,000, 7,000. That that seems okay. So let's put the scale in next. Got 1,000, 2,000, 3,000. 4,000, 5,000, 6,000, and 7,000. Okay, my next label is going to be this one, uh, and that's what these numbers actually are. Uh, we're, we're told here that we need to plot, plot a bar chart of numbers of tickets sold, so that's exactly what I'm going to put to say what these thousands represent. Number of tickets sold. That doesn't quite fit in that box, which is which is odd, because this is exactly what I would think to write. Uh, so number of tickets sold, uh, so if I had a bar that was, for example, uh, here, that would say that in May 3,000 tickets were sold. Well, in fact, in May it wasn't 3,000 tickets, it was 4,650. So let's take it up to 4,000. Now where's the 650? Well, this is 4,000 here, and this is 5,000, which means halfway between them, this, this sort of slightly bolder line, is 4,500, which is halfway between them. And the way I've done this scale also means that each of these little squares, that you can probably just about see, each of the little squares represents 100. So, 4,650, well this is 500, that line there. 4,600 is here. So if I'm being really precise, 4,650 is halfway up to the next one. Okay. So, again, because it's going up in hundreds, that's 4,000 here, 4,100, 200, 300, 400, 500, 600, and we're about halfway to 4,700. So, I mean, really, really precise. For June, we're at 4,250. So, again, up to 4,000, that's 4,000, 4,100, 4,200, 4,250. It's tricky to do because you have to be I'm trying to be so careful. Uh, there. Sure. Uh, July 3,520, so there's 3,000, there's 3,500, and I'm not even going to go halfway to the next one. I'm just going to leave it there. Finally, August 2,800, that's a nice round number. There's 2,000, there's 2,500, 600, 700, 800. A little higher. Oop, not that high. There. Cool, cool, cool. There is just one uh, box left that we haven't done, and that's this one up here, the title. Uh, so, what is, the, what, is, what is this doing? What is this graph? It's a bar chart, a bar chart, showing. And now let's think again about what the data actually is. This is data about the number of parking tickets that were sold from May to August 2014. I'm just reading from um, this, 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 piece, this line here. So, it's a bar chart showing the number of parking tickets sold. Uh, uh, go on, let's put some more information in there. In 2014. There we go, that's fine. Lovely. Now we can move on to part B.